Hi, my name is Amanda, and this is a Garden Smart video produced by the North Shore Recycling Program. A lack of carbon is the most common cause of problems in backyard compost bins. By the end of this video, you will know which common household materials you can use as a source of carbon in your compost bin. Without carbon, your bin will become slimy and smell bad. To ensure a healthy, odor-free compost, add equal amounts of green and brown material. For example, if I were to add my bucket of kitchen scraps, I would have to add an equal or greater amount of brown material. The most abundant brown source in nature are fallen leaves. As fallen leaves are not available year-round, it is important to store them. The equivalent of about four or five garbage cans of leaves should be enough to last one family for composting year-round. Although leaves are the best source of carbon, there are alternatives. Newspaper is an abundant and easily accessed source of brown. It must be ripped into one to two inch strips, separated and fluffed. What most people don't know is there are other common household papers that can be used as carbon sources. Egg cartons, napkins, toilet paper rolls, fruit trays, bags, and cardboard are all sources of carbon. Soil and grass clippings are not carbon sources. Here are some tips to ensure adequate carbon in your compost bin. Tip number one, try lining your collection bucket with a couple sheets of newspaper and then dumping the entire contents into your compost bin. Tip number two, try peeling veggies onto a couple sheets of newspaper, rolling up and then placing in your collection bucket. And tip number three, anytime you add kitchen scraps or green material to your compost bin, make sure you cover it up with a good thick layer of brown material, about two to four inches. No kitchen scraps should be visible when looking in your bin. Because composting won't be successful without carbon, make it a habit to include these sources of brown in your compost bin. For more information, visit our website.